Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel, the Python Gurukul. Today we will be talking about PyTest. So, so far we have been learning how to write the code. Now we'll start learning how to test our own code. So, we will be talking about PyTest, what it is, then we'll be going through how to install PyTest in Windows environment. And then we'll be writing our first PyTest. So uh, PyTest has prerequisites, and I want to highlight that already we know how to install. If you don't know, let's refer the video number one, where you have talked about installing Python. With Python, we should be also having package installer. And if we are not sure about pip or package installer, so watch the video number 13, and you should be familiar with that. Third and the last, so we got Python, we got package installer, and then we need to know how to create the virtual environment. And if you are not sure about that, refer my video number 14, how to create your own and use the virtual environment. Let's back to Python. So we will be just writing three commands. One is to create the environment, activate the environment, and install the PyTest. Once we are done with that, we will be looking into one of the sample program where I'm writing first program. And it has lots of detail here. We'll talk about them later, but today we want to write one program. And we just want to start running our program by saying PyTest. So let's go ahead, bring the screen here, and then we'll say, uh, Python minus M, we want to create the virtual environment and we want to give the name of virtual environment is PyTest Demo. Let's get created. So as it all got created, so let's go ahead and call the activate. So we are going to the virtual environment PyTest Demo to the script folder and then we are calling activate batch file. And now we are inside the PyTest demo. So next thing we need to do is call and we'll give the name of the package. We want to install the PyTest. And it's getting installed. And a couple of the information we'll check. It is installing some dependency as well. And then we can see that the PyTest has been successfully installed. And then version of the PyTest is 7.1.3 so let's go ahead check that pytest so respond to our pytest command so it responded and it said that it is not able to find any test let me go ahead bring the test case now the program very simple program nothing anything uh, but lots of things is going on. We are defining a new test case. We have to make sure that name align with uh, some naming convention. And then we have some status, assert statement, and that's all. So let's go back to the command prompt. From the command prompt, we will say that let's run the call the PyTest, and we want to run our test case, first test case from lab. And as soon as we call, the test case will be triggered. It will try to search for all the test cases from the module first.py. And it see that it found only one item. It called that one dot. And even in this screen, lots of things is going on. But for now, we had one test case. We ran the test case. And we got the result pass. So that's all for this video. So if you like my video, please share and subscribe. Thank you for watching.